I've got this basic illustration of a t-shirt and I want to add a logo to the top of it, so a flower motif. So I'm going to go to my layers panel on the side here, add a new layer and call this uh, logo. With this layer selected, I go to File, Place, and I choose my flowers design, which I want to go in. This is going to be quite a large piece, so I'm just going to drag like so. Now that's the right side, but the wrong place. I'm going to move it to being there, so it kind of covers the shoulder and neck area. But obviously that's covering over the entire illustration, rather than the place I want it to be. How do I get it to where I want to be? So I've got to add what's called a clipping mask, which means everything outside a certain area is removed. So what we do, go to view, outline. And here we can see the wireframe of the entire t-shirt. And I'm going to select this path here. Go to object, clipping mask, and then make. You don't see anything happening, but if I drop down on my layers, we'll see here there's clipping group. I drag this right up to the logo area. Sorry, I'm just take it to there. And go back to view GPU. So again, nothing has changed, but we see here the clipping group is in the logo. So I can expand this and take the linked file, the flower, and just left click and drag it into that group. You, I release and you see that it is now uh, only showing the bit inside the t-shirt. However, we have a slight problem which is that the stitching goes behind the image. This isn't really a problem. All we've got to do is find where the stitching is. So I'm going to just um, turn this layer off, put a new layer on, double click, stitching Probably spelled wrong, it doesn't really matter in this case, and we just have to select where the stitching is. So we've got one there, and drag this up to the top in stitching. Just, oops, left click, sorry, left click, drag, and move it in stitching. And got this one here, we see the little blue indicator there, to show us that we're doing that one. Left click, drag into stitching again, you can see them appearing, and we've got this piece. Here, which you can see there, drag it into stitching. Now we turn the logo back on. We can see that the stitching appears over the top of the image. The image itself is clipped to the t-shirt. Now if we want to move the t-shirt logo around, we just click on the um, expand here. Click on the little uh, target, the meatball to the right. And then we can just move this around and you see that as we move it, it moves within the clipping mask. So we can make the image uh, smaller, we can make the image larger, the clipping mask remains and our t-shirt remains exactly the design that we want.